हर साल करीब पंद्रह लाख बच्चे जेई के लिए अपेयर करते हैं करोड़ का ऑफर चार करोड़ रुपए समझ रहे हो बात पैसा ही पैसा हो गया कॉलेज प्लेसमेंट में बैठ नहीं पाते धीरे धीरे उस जल्दी में फंसते जाओ आई टी ने धोखा है One side you see them saying two crore ka package, four crore ka package, but on the other side you see a lot of people still not getting placed. Are they just lying to you? Are the placements at IIT is just a marketing gimmick by the coaching institutes? What is the actual truth about placements this year? Did the recession hit so hard that the students did not even get jobs? How many students actually got placed? How much really is the highest package? Two point six four crores or four crores? And how many students actually got the so-called crores of packages this year? Let's find out. <laughs> Hello everyone if you're new here my name is Tarun and I'm a final year student at IIT Kharagpur and before talking about anything else i just have to say that placements this year at IIT Kharagpur have been such a mess every newspaper article just says the highest is 2.6 crore crores but that's not true and then some people say that the highest package is 4 crores placements man such a mess you'll understand why i'm saying this but for now let me tell you what's there in this video first things first in the first minute i'm going to tell you how the entire placement procedure at iit is looks like and then we'll talk about the companies which actually pay in crores names of those companies and also how many people do they actually take and then we'll look into the highlights of the campus placements this year and finally i'm going to talk about the dark reality the 4 crore package ka story and why do i say that the placements have been such a mess this year let's get started let's go So if you don't know anything about the campus placements at IIT Kharagpur, this is the most simple way to understand it. Students in the final year register for the campus placement through CDC in the month of August, and then students make their CVs and resumes and upload it to the campus placement portal by the end of September. Placement exams happen in October, and finally the placement interviews happen in December, and then students finally get. placed so now this entire process is called the first phase of the placements and then the second phase starts from january but not a lot of companies come during the second phase and that's why students try their best to be placed in the first phase itself and also the highest placement package and all the good companies usually come in the first phase itself now before we talk about which company gave the highest placement package 2.64 crore or maybe 4 crore according to some people let's talk about how much do usually companies pay the iit students in the campus placements because some people think that everyone from iit earns in crores and all Now, here's the reality. So on the top we have the HFTs, the high frequency trading companies, something like Quanbox, Alpha Grip, Graviton, Maverick Derivatives, Davinci Derivatives. So all the crores of packages that you see are by these companies. But these companies usually take less than 0.5 percent of the entire number of students, which is very less. That's like the topmost layer of students even at IIT Kharagpur. See, becoming a topper and being at the top of the class is not so easy. And if you are preparing for IIT JEE right now, you know how much the competition is. You need to attend the class, make notes, solve questions, make short notes, revise the short notes, and so much more. But despite all this you might still end up having doubts and obviously not everyone would be comfortable enough to go to the class teacher and ask doubts and that's where the apps like philo come in see philo is the app where students can connect with top most tutors in india and ask unlimited number of questions on a one on one live private session in just a matter of 60 seconds you can literally ask any questions that you have and if you like a tutor you can mark them as your favorite and you can come back to them at any possible time this app is a game changer i've given the link in the description i know it's very useful thank me later now coming back Other companies like Optiver and Jane Street also pay in crores, but then they don't come here to hire IIT KGP students. Next up, we have some good software and data companies which pay around forty lakhs per annum. Examples are like Google, Microsoft, Nutanix, something like this. So most of these companies usually take computer science people or circuitry department people, and these companies usually take fifteen percent of the entire number of students, which is good. And then we have investment banking and finance companies which usually pay thirty-five lakhs per annum, and these people usually take like three point five percent of the entire number of students. And then we have consultancy companies. is which pay around 20 lakhs per annum but these people just take 1.25% of the students which is very less and finally we have software startups and other core companies which usually pay around 15 lakhs per annum the students as the analysis done by one of my friends aditya girish he says that more than 75% of the iit and sitting in the campus placement usually get placed in this category the 15 lakh category the software startups or core companies or the other miscellaneous blah, 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 you get the point and that's the reason if you see the average placement package of any iit that comes around 20 lakhs per annum and in fact lesser than 20 lakhs per annum for most of the departments so now let's get to the actual thing the actual statistics of the placements at iit kharagpur this year and also i'm going to spoil you with this information that the newspaper articles would say the highest placement package at iit kharagpur to be 2.64 crores is actually false mm. I'll tell you that entire story after 2 minutes but first here are the highlights of IIT Kharagpur ka campus placements this year let's go
firstly, this year IIT Kharagpur has been the fastest IIT to receive 1000 placement offers in just a span of 2 days. Last year this has been done in like 3 days but this year this has been done in like just 2 days. Second, we have the all time highest of the maximum amount received by the student in the history of IIT Kharagpur. Last year this has been 2.4 crores but this year this is much more than that. I'll tell you the exact figure later. Third, we had 1658 offers received in the first phase of IIT Ka campus placements. Last year this has been 1639, not a lot of increase but definitely an increase. But ladies and gentlemen, this is the place where everything gets a bit tricky. All the glorified data about IIT Kharagpur Ka campus placements. Just follow in the mountain. I'll tell you why. You see, IIT Kharagpur was the fastest to hit 1000 placement offers this year. But more than 550 of these are the pre-placement offers. Which means people who got their internships last year and then were offered full-time roles directly. So it's obviously not a right metric if you add those more than 550 pre-placement offers in this year's placement achievement. And then talking about the highest placement offer, which most of the newspaper articles said to be 2.64 crores, is actually not true. Because there is a guy in mathematics department, I'm obviously not going to tell the name out, but this guy applied to a company called Jane Street and was offered much more than 2.64 crores. He didn't want me to put the exact numbers in this video, but other sources say that the package is around 4 crores. Now you might be thinking this is actually good, but this is the bad part about it. Neither the highest package which was received last year or this year was through campus placements. These people applied off campus and got their offers. So now my question is why can't placement committee invite these companies to the placements here on campus? Especially when the same companies can go to IIT Kanpur and hire students from there. I don't know. Just a doubt or question. And then talking about the number of students who actually got placed. I see that around 2,573 students applied for the placements. But the total number of offers that were made in the first phase was 1,658 or something. Which means just 64.4% of the people were placed. What about the rest? And then in a post by Avas, the official student body of IIT Kharagpur, they say that around 76.46% of the registered undergraduate students were placed. So what about the rest? And then the condition is much more worse for the MTech students. So now with all this information, I just can say that the campus placements this year, even at IITs, has had a bad turn due to the recession. And I'm not even sure how bad it might have been in other colleges and all. So for all the students who are still applying for placements, who are still applying for jobs, man, keep trying, stay strong, and I wish you all the best. And for all the JE aspirants who are watching this, here's a pro tip. You have to know that there are departments like instrumentation which have had average placement package as good as electrical engineering. And then departments like industrial and systems engineering which had better placements than mechanical. But some students with better JE ranks still don't choose these departments because of lack of awareness. So look out for these. And now with all these things being said, that's all for this video. A lot of research went behind this. And we are having a class today at 8 p.m. sharp. So if you're a JE aspirant, be there. Take the link in the description. And I'll see you very soon. Yo, yo. Microphone check, make it a microphone check. Give it a microphone, I make them make it a microphone dead.